Yo, what's good, everybody? SOS Wrestle Talk coming back at y'all once again for more New Japan Pro Wrestling coverage, news, all that kind of stuff. This time, we're going to be talking about the New Japan Cup final that actually took place this morning. We're going to be talking about the main event, which was the New Japan Cup final itself, and maybe kind of a little preview of Sakura Genesis. We only have one match on the card right now, so not really much of a preview. If you didn't know, our final matchup is going to be Yoda Suji taking on Hiroki Goto, a man who has won many of New Japan Cups. I think he's won three of them, if I'm not mistaken, off the top of my head. So we got Hiroki Goto taking, taking on a young upstart in Yoda Suji. And yeah, Yoda Suji was able to get the victory. So repping LIJ, of course, he got the victory. Uh, it was in Nagoya. Uh, he actually encountered a Rainmaker attempt by Goto into a Gene Blaster. Then he hit him with another Gene Blaster to put him away. Hair over 23 minutes right here. Definitely recommend going to check this match out. This match was very... They, both of these boys cooked, with the, as the young kids would say. They was cooking out here, and they prepared a very well <laughs> delicious a delicious meal is what I uh, the term I'm looking for. These boys was cooking. Like I said, getting his first victory in the New Japan Cup right here. And I even uh, spoke about it on the preview with Suji winning, he actually already has a pocketed never open weight title shot whenever he wants, if he if he wants to take it, considering what may happen. Or he can go ahead and challenge for that IWGP World Heavyweight Championship if he's going to do that, which is what you get when you win the New Japan Cup. I mean, I, it was back in the day you could challenge for, I think, was it the Intercontinental Never Open Weight or the IWGP Heavyweight, but as of late... People have even have just challenged for the heavyweight belt, even though David Finlay had made it made a statement to where if he had won, he would challenge the, for the global heavyweight title, which I thought that would have been kind of interesting. So with the result of US, <coughs> Yoda Suji, excuse me, winning the New Japan Cup, he is now going to be taking on his stable leader, uh, stable being Los Ingobernables Day Upon, Tetsuya Naito for the IWGP World Heavyweight Championship. Of course, that match is going to be the main event at Sakura Genesis 2024. April 6th, I believe that is going to be on the Sunday. I believe that's WrestleMania weekend. That is WrestleMania weekend. So we only have one match on the card. The rest of the matches will unfold here in the next couple of days. We're back at it on the road to Soccer Genesis on the 30th of March. So be on the lookout for that. But yes, Yoda Suji, the Gene Blaster, has broken through. He is now the winner of the New Japan Cup and will challenge for the IWGP World Heavyweight Championship. This will be a second attempt. He challenged, uh, I believe, Sonata last year at Dominion. Of course, came up unsuccessful. So he's going to attempt to wrest the World Heavyweight Championship away from his leader, his stablemate, Tetsuya Naito. Will he be successful? Find out next time on Dragon Ball Z. No, I'm just kidding. We'll find out here in a little bit if he's going to be able to be successful or not. Um, you know, it's, as long as the belt's still in LIJ, I'm fine. But, you know, a little selfishly, I would like Naito to keep holding the belt. But without any further ado, we're at SOS Wrestle Talk. I am the person who fly God. I'm getting up out of here, y'all. Y'all take care. Peace.